Okay, what's up guys? Uh, my guess is you're here to make money. You're here to learn how to make money online and I'm here to teach you how to make money online without charging you for it. My name is Mark Augustine. Um, I've been drop shipping on four different marketplaces, five different platforms over the past 10 years. I've sold over $20 million. And in this video, what we're going to talk about is the 30 steps to getting approved to Walmart Marketplace. Getting approved to sell on Walmart Marketplace. Why are we talking about this? So over the years, I've been doing eBay dropshipping, Facebook dropshipping. There's a link in the description to that. Amazon dropshipping, Walmart, the whole nine, right? Facebook is the new eBay dropshipping. Walmart is the new Amazon dropshipping. And the barrier to entry is actually getting approved on Walmart Marketplace. Now, in order to get approved, you need a corporation. You need a list of stuff. So in this video, we're going to go through the full course that we have. There's a link in the description. The course is only 500 bucks right now. At the end, in about a week or two, we'll raise the course to $1,200. But right off, you get it. Right now, you get it for $500. <coughs> if you plan to come to Grand Camp, you also get a discount. But right now, the course is 500 bucks. So, <coughs> so the, the 30 steps. So in order to get approved for Walmart Marketplace, you need to have a corporation. In order to get a corporation, you need to know the basics. You need to know the terminology. What's an LLC? What's a social security number, tax ID, articles of a corporation, so on. So the first part of the course goes through that. Then you need to know how to set up an LLC or corporation, and we go through a, top, a couple options for that. Then the third step, how to get an EIN as a U.S. resident, because anyone on earth, whether it's U.S. resident or foreigner, you can sell on Walmart Marketplace. Now, if you are not a U.S. resident, you can also get an EIN as a non-U.S. resident, and we go through that as well. So, this fifth step, there are two important documents that you need to fill out, 1099, W8, a couple different things. We go through step by step. The fifth step is making sure that your documentation is correct and everything is set up to get approved. Sixth, is we go through how to get a bank account for U.S. Um, residents. Seventh, how to get a bank account for non-U.S. residents. Because as I said, this this opportunity for anyone on earth. Eighth, how to get a DUNS number, and I'll do a separate video on that here on YouTube. Nine, what would Walmart use your DUNS number for? DUNS number is like the source, similar to the social security number of your business. It's a, it's used for risk, risk assessment. And we go through a bit why Walmart wants that and how, it, how it's used. 10, how to get a phone number. Because and not any and every phone number is equal. Some people try to use Google Voice. You need a specific service that, that registers with Yellow Pages and some other stuff. Step 11, how to get a, a website. So we go through who, where you can get websites, how, how you can get them cheaply, and so on. Um, 12, we talk about the advantage of using solution providers. What, what does that mean? 13, the secret to, to guaranteed approvals. There are a couple different ways that in our experience we have guaranteed approvals. At my company, we have gotten approved for over 100 Walmart accounts, and this is, this, we go through every one of these steps. 14, we know you're going through the process, but why Walmart, Walmart Marketplace? 15, company registration. I'm not going to click through everyone. 16, product education. 7, shipping and operations. Eight, 18, confirmation. 19, message confirmation. All of these are steps that Walmart goes through, and we show you how to do it correctly. 20, the introduction, account creation. 21, onboarding. 22, how to set up your company information with Walmart. 23, how to set up customer service with Walmart. 24, how to set up management contact. 25, how to set up shipping. 26, how to set up return. 27, how to set up privacy. 28, how to set up taxes. 29, how to set up access. 30, how six reasons not to be approved. So basically, these are the 30 steps or the 30 data points that are very important to guarantee a free approval on Walmart. You don't. You can get approved without the course. We've had a lot of people try to get approved. Some people got approved. Some people got denied. But this course and these thirty steps pretty much guarantees. And we go through step by step and show you what needs to be done. Who are the service providers you go to? And with this course and maybe about three hundred bucks, you're pretty much guaranteed to get approved for Walmart. Once you get approved, you can sell it for five to ten thousand dollars and keep it moving. Anyway, 
like my video subscribe to my channel in the description i have a link to this course you want to purchase it for 500 dollars before it goes up ask me any questions about walmart marketplace facebook marketplace we'll do some product research later i did a video on on um pricing strategy for facebook have a good one guys later